Hi, friends. Welcome to Enlightened World Network. Dr. Ruth Anderson here for a meditation a day. Today, our beautiful guest meditator is Sue Broom. She's coming to us from Arizona and so looking forward to this magical meditation with Sue. One of the things I love about working with Sue is she never knows where her meditation is going. And she works with the angels, she works with spirit, and it's always fresh and up to the minute. She she doesn't read a meditation that she wrote six months ago. It's whatever they're guiding her to at that moment. So Sue, thank you so much for being here with us. Thank you for having me. And did you see, as soon as you started talking, the chimes, the chimes chimed in. Love it. So um, yeah. Okay. Well, Sue, I'm going to get out of your way and let you take us where you're where you're being led. All right. Here we go. Here we go, everybody. So, if some of you know this from from past, I like to have crystals. Sometimes I have different ones in my hands, but I like to have because sometimes my hands are just moving along the crystals. So if you want to have crystals in your hands, go ahead. If you don't, that's wonderful as well. So first, get yourself in a comfortable position, whether it's if you're sitting down or if you're reclining back or if you're lying down, whatever's going to be most comfortable for you. And just take a deep breath in through the nose. and out through the mouth. And again, a couple, couple deep breaths. And if you haven't already and would like to, you can close your eyes. And you might notice with each exhale that your body relaxes a little bit more. Maybe your arms are going limp or your fingers all of a sudden relax. Maybe you notice the stresses in your forehead or on your scalp. Just relax. If you have a part of your body, maybe your foot that's just can't stop moving, just allow it to be. It may relax, it might not. And take another deep breath. And I'd like you to notice the angels that are gathering around you. Whether there's one or whether there's 10 or whether there's a hundred, just notice. And notice They are archangels or task angels that just would like to assist for a specific task. And if you don't know, that's okay. Maybe as you're noticing, maybe there's a color that's associated with some of them. Just notice. Some of them might appear taller. Some might just be the appearance of light.
some you might get a name and you might not. You may get a sound. Just notice. And as you're noticing, feel the support that you receive. Just be in this energy of support right now. And what that feels like is different for everyone. Maybe, maybe you're feeling a little more relaxed. Maybe you're feeling cocooned in love. Maybe you're feeling like there's not a, a worry in the world. Everything is in divine order. Everything is taken care of. There's nothing for you to do in this moment. All you need to do is be. Just noticing. You might be taking longer and deeper breaths. You might feel as if you're just sinking into your chair. You might even feel as if you are floating. Imagine yourself reaching out your hand to touch one of these angels. As you start to reach out your hand, one of them steps forward, reaches back to you, you can feel their loving energy even more expanded. Might feel like a surge of energy. It might feel as if you have just received a hug from the inside out. There's a softness of gentleness. It feels as if they're touching you and yet it doesn't. But you know, you know they are there. You know their energy is totally connected with yours. Maybe there's a color that they have just sent to you. Maybe there's a sound that you notice that's associated with this angel. Your body feels so comfortable, so relaxed, so healthy, so
so full of life. If this angel has a message for you, allow yourself to hear it with your ears now or hear it with your heart for later. Just knowing that you've received a gift from this angel. You feel so much love and so much appreciation and gratitude for all the support that is here. And as you thank this angel, allow yourself to turn your attention to another angel. Maybe there was a color that you noticed that you were drawn to. Maybe there was just a pull of your energy And again, just notice, is there a color? Is there a sound? What is the energy of this angel all about? Feel it in your heart. Feel it in your body. You may feel their energy just holding your hand. Just allowing the love, the appreciation that you are who you are, coming from the angel to you. And just feel this energy, this love. truly is a gift that you can feel, not only in your hand, but in your entire being. And just take a breath and just be with this angel. Still feeling the support of all, all the other angels surrounding you. And this angel may also have a message for you for this very moment. or for a future time. Just allow yourself to accept this message. And thank this angel for this special gift.
and allow yourself to just feel this loving energy from all of these angels supporting all of the cells of your being. They are always here with you. Supporting you. Loving you. Appreciating who you are. And what you have to offer. Thank them all for being with you, for their support. And slowly start coming back into your body. Knowing that whatever each angel gifted you in this moment, in this time, in this short time that we have been here in this meditation. Just know that their love and their energy and their gift is with you. So come back into your body. And allow yourself to start getting acclimated back. Back into the room you are in. Back into the chair you might be sitting in. Or reclining in. And with each breath, you'll notice more aspects of your body. Your arms, your hands, your legs and your feet. And you'll notice as you're coming back into your body, There's a renewed energy that is flowing through your body. Renewed vitality. And take a deep breath and maybe move your head from side to side. Move your feet and your ankles and your fingers and your toes. And maybe stretch. And take one more deep breath, coming back and opening your eyes if you haven't already. Oh, <laughs> Sue, so that was a beautiful time with the angels. And we haven't done that before. So thank you. No, that's not where I thought we were going. So that was that was pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. You know, friends, if if this meditation was as impactful for you as it was for me, share it to yourself. Send it to yourself on Facebook Messenger, and you can always go back in and watch this one again anytime you want to be with the angels. It's very interesting. So what, if you don't mind sharing, what impressions did you have from that time with the angels? First, how many angels were you seeing? <laughs> you mentioned colors. Were you seeing particular colors? 
You know, I don't know if I know how many angels because I know that some of them were behind me. So, and around me, I it wasn't like there was tons of them behind me, but what I felt was the support. It, it, it literally felt like each cell of my body had extra support. And I, I, I really didn't see any colors associated, which is kind of surprising. I was seeing more, more white, the bright, and it, it wasn't like bright where, oh my gosh, I can't see. But there was an infusion to the white energy, if that makes sense. And even as I say that now, it's like if you imagine all of your cells, you know, little round cells floating around, it's like each one had a light or a glow to it that was coming from the angels. And as I say that, I get chills. So. It was very cool. Well, it was interesting because I didn't notice height difference until you pointed it out. And I didn't notice color difference until you pointed it out. But when you mentioned height difference, then I did see some that were definitely taller. And as I stood next to them, they were taller and whiter and brighter. And they just felt so wise that the difference in the field standing next to them versus some of the others was remarkable. And I would like to go back in and spend some time with those. I, I had not experienced that before. So that was very cool. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And as you're saying that, I'm getting chills. It's, it, it is really interesting because, and it's, you know, the angels aren't, aren't saying, well, I'm taller. So, you know, they, they don't go there at all, but they're, I, I think, you know, we as humans will do that. And it's funny because I didn't necessarily see them as taller, but the, because I didn't see them as, as like people, I saw them as, as beams of light. <laughs> it is so interesting how each of us will experience it in our own way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you so much. So what do you want friends to know about you? Uh, if, if you would like to learn how to connect with your angels, you can go to my go to my website um, and either I can, you know, working with people from a healing perspective, sometimes that is exactly what people want to know is how they can connect with their own angels because everybody has their angels. I'm not, I'm not any more special than anybody else. Everybody connects with their angels. And this, this meditation is a wonderful place to start if you've never worked with angels or if you want to start meditating more with them. This is a, a great meditation. So it is. it is a great meditation to start with, yes. All right. And so you can be found at subroom.com. Yep. Subroom.com. Find out more about me and the angels. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Sue. And friends here at Enlightened World Network, thank you for being open to exploring. You know, we are given this amazing opportunity every single day to meet with a different uh, light worker, go into meditation and see what spirit has there for us today. And we're all on our own individual spiritual curriculum. So wherever you are right now in your spiritual understanding is absolutely perfect exactly the way it's supposed to be. So thank you for being here. Take good care. God bless and we'll see you soon.